Dr. Matty Way. Church of God of Prophecy. Amen. We go way, way, way back. I won't tell you how far. You start trying to figure things out. But I leave you in suspense. Hear ye the word of God. Lift your hands and point in this direction. Lord, Lord send the word. Send the word. Help me to receive the word. And go out that door and demonstrate what I've heard. God bless the preacher.
that I bless God for everything that He has done for me, for us down through the years. And God is still doing great things for us. Amen. 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 I thank God for every one of those um, little shopping trips we used to go on. They weren't necessarily shopping trips, they were ministry trips, weren't they? They were ministry trips. Amen. And we got to do some shopping in between. Amen. Amen. I still think that often. Think of Tiffany, and I used to hear her say, "We're going to shop for the <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. And she liked that. She to shop. I think she got that from her mother. Whatever she got it from, it was in the family. We were all in there. We were all shopping. <laughs> Thank God we didn't drop. <laughs> I think uh, Pastor Bill will get him back to D.C. before y'all talk. <laughs> and he wanted to make sure y'all had some tithes and offerings in the chat. Amen. 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 So he, he's a man of money also. You know, he can manage money. Amen. Most good pastors are good money. Most good, I would say good pastors. Oh, good money man. Hiring yeah. is not good money. Good pastor, good people in the church, good money man. Yes. Amen. Amen. So the Lord, God is good. God, I bless you. I praise you. I just, God, I just give you praise and glory for this morning. I thank you, Lord, for this time. This time of refreshing. We thank you, Holy God, for the word of God that you bring into our hearts and to our minds today, gracious Lord. And Father, as I decrease, that the Holy Spirit increase. That the power of God rule and reign, my God, in this house today, gracious Lord. In this vessel, Lord, take it and do what you will of with it today, my Lord. I yield my body, my soul, my mind. I yield everything to you, Lord God, that you will be glorified. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Sometimes you don't know where you're going, how you're going, why you're going. When you follow the Jesus, you know you just going. We just follow him because he's the lead, he's the guide, he's the protector, he's everything. And he knows best how to take us where we are going. The song that says, when you lead me, I will follow. It would do us well to take that as part of our motto for our life. Let him lead. Make sure that he leads. One thing for certain when he leads, we will end up where we need to be. No guessing game at all. We will end up in the right place or places when we allow him to lead. Amen. 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 The same thing goes with the household, the husband and the wife. Both of y'all can't leave at the same time, but y'all got to be together. Yeah. 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 And you got to respect each other. Yeah. Yeah. And if you do that, you'll end up where you need to be. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Every time. Every time. Every time. Amen. So in the word of God, let me go on. <coughs> in the word of God, in the fifth chapter of the gospel according to Matthew. Matthew uh, 5 and 14, he says, Ye are the light 
of the world. Father, you know that he means you. Amen. 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 Ye are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill cannot be hidden. Nor is there any hidden place that is lit on a candlestick. And it gives light unto all. That are in your house. Yeah. 16 verse says this. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good ones and glorify your Father which is in heaven. Amen. 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 If God Wait. 
things that I want to any way that I please. My life has to be lived to the glory of God. That the Lord God may be manifested through my life. We can't say anything good about anybody unless something has been manifested through that life span. Like we've done something here today for Brother Ross the Healing. And the worst thing we can do is get up. Thank you. <laughs> Nobody knows me down here in this part of the, 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 the Washington, D.C. Nobody knows me. So I can let my hair down today. I can do anything. Uh-huh. I can be anywhere. I can, hey, hey, dude, you know, <laughs> I can do all of these things. But you know what? Somebody's looking. Somebody see. You may not see me, but God sees. There's nothing and no one that's hidden from the sight of God. And at no time, at no time. So we're not getting away. Okay? We're not getting away. That's why he gives us the instructions. Let your light shine. Because the light that shines on the good work that you or I are doing will bring glory to the Father. Amen? Amen. Will bring glory to the Father. And if it doesn't do that, you can make up all the stories you want to make up. <laughs> when I've sung my last song, I've raised, raised my last breath. You can say all the things that you want to say about me. But you don't see that unseen thinking that was writing all the time when I'm doing something else or when you're doing something else. And whatever that something else is, it is not bringing glory to the Lord. But when it glorifies the Lord, he blesses us. He's pleased with us. When he's glorified, when he's glorified, the devil is horrified. Uh -huh. Because he's lost another round. Amen. Amen. He's lost another round. So we're trusting in the almighty God. Whether you're young, whether you're old, whether you're 10 or 50, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. When the Lord God Almighty said that all souls are mine, they all belong to him, he has the last say. We can think that we have the last say, we have the last breath. Yeah. We have the last breath. You can have that. You can get that 
to you. You have the last breath, but not the last say. Amen. Hey, he has the last say. Oh, Amen. 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 So I praise God today for the power of God. Amen. And for the anointing of God. Amen. Amen. Because nothing works without the anointing. That's true. <laughs> Hey, glory to God. Amen. We may be gifted and talented, can sing like angels. I started to say mockingbirds. Mockingbirds sing? I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, anyway, whatever it is. But if, but if this life is not matching up to what God has ordained for us to do, we can hang it up. Yeah. We can hang it up. Yeah. We can hang it up. Because it doesn't amount to anything. Amen. But I'd rather please God. Yeah. Amen. Amen. He like him. He said, I just want to please the Lord. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. And when God was was time for um, God to do something with him, he just took it. That's all he did. <laughs> That's all. He just took it. You can't find an obituary. You can't. <laughs> You can't find any of that stuff about Enoch. Right. God just took it. And his desire was that I please God. Yeah. What's your desire? What's your desire? What's your desire? Please the pastor. Please go faster. Please the musicians, the choir, choir director. Mm. Please the elder Matt. Mm -mm. My desire is for your desire <laughs> to please God. Amen. 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 Because all I can do for you is say, oh, I enjoyed the word coming through you today. I enjoy how the Lord used you today. Hmm. I enjoy the song. It was beautiful. Touched my heart. But that's as far as I can go with that. Yeah. That's, it. Yeah. That's as far as I can go with that. But you got another mandate. <laughs> and somebody else is writing. <laughs> somebody else has everything all lined up waiting for you. <laughs> somebody had a song, uh, uh, sang a song of the choir back a few years back. And the gist of the song was that this person had lived their life. Uh -huh. and, and now they're passed on. And when they stood before the Lord, somebody say St. Peter, I don't know who will be there. As long as I'm there, that's all right. He said, uh, I know my name is there. And they said, Peter, no, I don't see your name anywhere. He said, check it again. <laughs> check it again, because my name has to be there. He checked again, and the name was not there. Are you sure? You served the Lord all these years, all these years. All these years, I served the Lord, and then the person started naming all of these things that they did. But, but nothing Works. had to do with faith. Yeah. Nothing yeah. had to do with the love of God. Mm -hmm. Nothing had to do with ministry. Right. Nothing right. had to do with feeding yeah. somebody. Mm -hmm. Nothing. None of it. All the things that this person did in all of his life. Yes. He went to church dressed up looking good every Sunday. Yeah. Okay? Mm -hmm. But he did not love God. Mm -hmm. Mm. Wow. Mm. So I can love coming.
coming to uh, redeeming love, right. I almost went back down the road. You <laughs> can always enjoy coming to redeeming love. Tell it. Uh -huh. But when my life span is ended and I cross the chilling tide, it will not be redeeming love. Christian outreach who's going to receive me over on the other side. Right. It won't be there. Right. They're going to be right here. <laughs> They're going to be right here. And we're going to be over there yeah. trying to justify why I belong here and not there. I still think sometimes that people think that God is not real. I think that they think that he's somebody to play with. Yes, they do. I think they think that they can change his mind. With a dollar bill or a ten dollar bill or a hundred dollar bill or whatever. Yeah. We can't change his mind. <laughs> the songwriter said it real good. He said, When I see the blood, I'll pass on it. Yeah. I'll pass on it. That's what was for the children of Israel. Yeah. But they were told to get the blood and put it on the doorpost. Because the death angel was coming through yeah. uh, that night. Yeah. And God says, when I see the blood, I'm going to pass over you. Oh, <laughs> I'm not going to allow anything to happen to you. Amen. And so when we're covered under the blood of Jesus Christ, yeah. my God, when God looks on us, he doesn't care about Hot, what kind of suit that you here? Care about this hot roll that I'm walking around here? He doesn't care about any of that stuff. He wants to see his son's blood. Are we covered with the blood of Jesus Christ? Because that's whose blood counts. So it has to be smeared on us. We have to be covered. You say, I'm covered. Yes, I'm covered by his blood. Yeah. If you had your blood back, if you haven't, you better get it. Yeah. It's time. It's time. It's time to be examples. It's time to be examples, every one of us. From the youngest to the oldest in your school on tomorrow. Yeah. Be an example. Yeah. Don't be like all of the other kids who are yeah. doing whatever. Yeah. Who are saying whatever they want to say. Be a good example. Yeah. And we talked this morning about Deacon McKeith. <laughs> And the scholarship fund and everything that's uh, being started in his name. It may not be a scholarship fund for you. It may not be a scholarship fund for me. But the life that I live is going to write my story. And it's going to be a reflection on who I really am. And whether or not it touched you, that's not up for me to say. Because the life that I live is for you to see. And that's why the word of God says that men may see your good work and glorify who? The Father. Go glorify the Father. To glorify my Father, which is in heaven. Jesus. So don't miss out on your reward because your focus is on giving glory to the wrong persons. 
our persons. Amen. Amen. Because all that we do, all that we stand for in this world should be about Jesus. Amen. It should be about Jesus. Everywhere we go, it should be about Jesus. And so everybody can stand and say whatever they want to say about whomever they want to say it about, but it seems like we don't want to say anything about Jesus. Come on, man. But he is the way. He's the only way. That's right. Amen. There's no either or. Amen. Yes. And somebody told me one of the movie stars or movie stars like said, um, heaven has two dimensions. And you can get there anyway. Sound like a don't believe that. That's right. Don't believe the lie. <laughs> Don't believe that. Now, that 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 is a lie. Yes. Because Jesus said this. I am the way, the truth, and the life. So anything else that's coming before us is a lie, and the truth is not in it. So don't be. Don't be. Don't be fooled. Bamboo. And they're taken back by the crazy thing that people say. Okay. Oh, someone will think, well, she's got millions of dollars or whatever, and she can say anything she wants to say. She surely can. Mm. But you don't have to believe. That's, That's it. Right. That's, That's it. Right. That's right. You better get into your word. You better Amen. believe your word. Amen. If you're not in it, you better get in it. Because that's the only thing that's going to help us. I'm finding that that's all that's going to help me. Amen. And that's all that's going to help you. Amen. So I'm not getting there anyway. I'm not getting there on skateboard. Right. <laughs> I'm getting there through some hard knocks. I'm getting there through some trials. I'm getting there through some tribulations. But I know my God is able. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I know my God is able to deliver me through all of these things that I go through. And the beautiful thing about it is that I'm going through it. I'm not staying in it. Uh, Hallelujah. I'm going to get to the other side. If you don't give up, if you don't give up, if I don't give up, when I don't give up, I'm making tracks. Yeah. So I'm getting to the other side. Yeah. Amen. 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 But if I just stand here and make That's track, right. just stand here, stand in place, stand in place, yeah. stand in place, marking time. Yeah. That's what mummies and dummies do. <laughs> okay? All right. Knowing that you got to go someplace that you got to move back. That's place. right. You know, got here. Yeah. I'll never make it to that wall. All of this I can do this all day long and accomplish nothing. Nothing. So be a light to somebody. I didn't give you a topic. <laughs> I didn't give you a topic. I just started, read the scripture, pray, and kept going, didn't I? If you don't have the topic by now, huh? It's the word of God in, in um, Matthew 5 and 16 say, let your light so shine before men. Before men. That they may see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. So be a light wherever you are. Be, be a light. Be a good light. Be a light that's going to bring glory to our Father. That's it. <laughs> Amen. 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 Amen
Amen. Trust in Jesus. And you notice the word of God said, let your light shine. Yeah. Somebody's always trying to make something shine. Yeah. Got, a, got a dull bulb. Thank you, Lord. Uh, uh, All rusted out. Uh, Some water done got in it. Uh, <laughs> you trying to screw that thing into that socket. Because you can't make it work. Uh -oh. <laughs> you can't make it work. That's right. So now, as we journey along this path, singing and praying and worshiping as we go, pointing souls toward the crimson flow. Everywhere we go, that's what it's all about. So you want, and I want, we want, at the end of this life, wherever it may be, I heard the pastor say we were in the, in the fourth quarter. The fourth quarter of life. Fourth quarter. But that's where we are. These old lights can shine so bright. Amen. Amen. Because there's so much darkness in the world. And so if we become just like the world, our lights go out. That's right. So wherever you are, wherever you go, keep in mind that God has given you a light. <laughs> and the reason that he gave it to us Amen. is that we can use it to point others to him. Yeah. Yeah. That's why. That's why we live these lives. That's why he said, let your light shine. Let it shine. Be a light. Be a light for Jesus today. Be a light wherever you go. Be a light. Be a light for Jesus. Not for yourself. Yourself, myself, promise nothing. But by faith in the Lord Jesus Christ, we can teach and show others the way. So be a, be a light for Jesus every day. Amen. 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 And keep your light trimmed and burning. Lights go out when the wick burn down, right? But as long as they're trimmed, at least they they burn evenly, and they will not set up a smoke stream. Not get a city, uh, yeah, city glow, no blades. Everything coming right into it. Amen. 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 Let your light shine. That's it. Be a life of Jesus every day. Amen. Amen. That's what you want to be. That's what I want to be. Amen. That's what I want to be. Glory to God. Thank God for you. Thank you for your, your attention and your time. My Lord, my Lord. Glory to God. Keep trusting the Lord. Keep trusting Him. Keep trusting Him. Amen. Amen. God bless you today. I just feel like this is is all that I need to say today. I just feel that uh, it's time for the pastor to bring it in. Come on. Come on over here.
for his son. We thank you for the life and example that he lived in front of all of us. We give you the glory and we give you the praise. For this is a day of celebration. And we give it to you, God. And what you put in this man to put before us. He allowed his light to shine. That we may see your good works and glorify the heaven, Father in heaven. We thank you and we praise you. In Jesus' name. Amen and amen. With up to hand, may the grace of our Lord and the sweet communion of the Holy Spirit rest brood and abide with us now, henceforth and forevermore. Let us all say amen. Consider yourself dismissed.